If you're wanting to text US-based numbers, you'll have to register your number with the carrier networks. And this registration process is called 10DLC. And in this video, I wanna break down a uh, part of that 10DLC registration process that we see our customers get stuck at a lot of times. So what is 10DLC? 10DLC is a registration process started by the major cellular carriers to help weed out spam while making sure legitimate businesses like yours could continue to get their messages delivered. And as part of your registration process, you do have to show your opt-in flow, or in other words, how you're getting people to sign up to be texted. An SMS opt-in is where you're getting someone to type in their information and consent to your business texting them, or in other words, they're opting in to be texted by you. And this can happen in web forms, text to join keywords, flyers, when you purchase something online in a few other ways, but the big thing that we're going to cover in this video is how to set up this opt-in so it's compliant and passes the 10 DLC registration process. Now, Sales Message does our best to make this as easy as possible for you from built-in compliance to AI assisting you along the way. We do everything we can to make this process easy. I just wanna make sure you know exactly what goes into these opt-ins so it's legally compliant and then doesn't cause your registration to be rejected. Because when you get this part right, along with a few key factors for your application, you can move through the registration process in days rather than weeks. When you're applying, there's a few different ways that you can submit your opt-in for approval. Through web form, which is usually the most standard and the easiest, but you can also show a text to join keyword flow, a paper form, or whatever way you're having people opt into your text list. The method you choose isn't as important as showing the right language and providing disclosures where you're having people opt in. This helps confirm to the carriers that you're not a spammer and will help you get your registration approved the first time around. So there needs to be some notification to the person opting in that they're agreeing to receive SMS messages and data rates may apply. The message frequency or that the message frequency may vary and a link or a URL to the terms and privacy policy on your website. Now with a web form, it makes this process really easy because you can put all of this information in the form itself, like in this example, where you can see the compliance language on the form. But here's a full list of all the information an opt-in needs to include. But just please note that this seems like a long list, but it can all be inserted into a single paragraph like the one you see on the screen. It needs to have a program name or a description of the messages that are gonna be sent, the fee disclosure, uh, service delivery frequency, or recurring message disclosure, meaning how many messages per month and that kind of stuff. There's customer care information, like if you need help, text help, uh, to this number, opt-out instructions, how you can stop these messages, and finally, a link to a privacy policy describing how end-user opt-in information will be used. Um, uh, just a note here, it is usually prohibited to share data collected from opt-ins with third parties. And you do also need to link to the terms and conditions describing uh, your terms of service on your website. And then finally, incorporate a checkbox that the user has to check off to consent to the above and confirm the opt-in. So you see this on a lot of web forms, but you, you can pre-populate this check, but they need to be able to uncheck it and still be able to subscribe. And here's a great example of a compliant keyword opt-in. You can see it has all of the same information listed as well as the full URLs. So making sure that you have this information on your opt-in web form, your paper form, or your text to join keyword will not only keep you compliant, but it'll help your chances of approval. And as you register for 10 DLC compliance with sales message, as I mentioned earlier, you really only need to have your information ready to go. We've built compliance into the app as well as AI assistant to make sure that uh, sales message makes it as easy as possible for you to get through the 10 DLC registration process. So if you have any questions on opt-ins or need help getting this taken care of, please reach out to our support team so we can help you get approved and texting as fast as possible. Thanks for watching.